Hey guys, this is a guide to remove Spigot or Search Protection from your PC. So first go to Start, Control Panel, and then you can open up Programs and Features, and then scroll right down, and it will show under S for Search Protection with a little magnifying glass, and has a screenshot. This just shows what it looks like when it's uninstalling. So as you can see, it's gone because I removed it earlier, and that's how you would in uninstall. And now we're going to go back to start, and we're going to type in here, search protection, just to make sure there's no excess files sitting on your PC somewhere. And you can also check for spigot. And then we're going to go to start again, and type in reg e D I T Reg Edit to bring up the registry of your PC. And here we go. Now you'll go to Edit, go to Find, and this will search for what you want. So type in Spigot. And then this will take anywhere between a few seconds to maybe a minute, depending on your PC speed. So it should be done pretty soon. And there we go. Scroll up to the top, and you're going to look for anything that says Search Protection or Spigot. You don't want to delete anything else because you don't know what it is. Like I've got Internet Explorer files on here. And then if you keep going down, and then eventually, as the it already highlighted, it highlighted that star page for me. I'm going to delete that because it's a Yahoo based search thing. And yeah, we're clear there. Now go back to edit, find, and now we're going to type in search protection and see if anything additionally comes up. This may take a bit longer because it's scanning your entire PC for a very common word so it could take up to a couple of minutes depending on how quick your PC processes and there you see it finished and there was no new results to show this is the same screen again so we're all good let's close it down and now you're gonna have to change your browser back to your original one so this is Internet Explorer go to Internet Options on the little cogwheel and then just type in what you want it to be at so I chose Google then you click apply and make sure it's set to start home page on that little box now if we close this down and reopen it it should be Google, and it is. So, yep, we're sorted there. Now on to Chrome. Chrome's a bit more advanced. So, let's go to the top. Go to the settings. And the first thing we're going to do is go to this option here and click Set Pages. And then you'll see I've got the Yahoo web search in there. All I'm going to do is click X. And there we go. Now I'm going to just double check it's gone. Yep, it's gone. Okay. Now we're going to go down to this bit here under Appearance, and we're going to do the same thing. Just type in the web search you want. So again, I'm going to go for Google. Okay. And then under Search here, this is your default search engines. So you're going to click Manage Search Engines. And as you can see, it's defaulted to Yahoo, which I do not want. You can't click X on it until you make Google or another web search your default, so click default and then you're going to click the X here. And there we go, it's gone. Now I'm just going to um, load this up, see, this is fine, and going to close down Chrome and then reopen Chrome and there you go, back on Google as it should be. So I hope this has helped some people. If it has, please give me a like. It does help me out. And um, have a nice day.